Joe Lambiet earned plenty of praise for his utter dismantling of DeAndre Jordan, Willie Reed aka. What's his name and the Los Angeles Clippers on Monday night? As it turned out, though, JoJo was just getting warmed up for what would be his real Staples Center showcase, and the surest sign, yet that the Philadelphia 76ers, young and odd, and all of a sudden as they feel, are very real, and potentially brilliant, and already pretty damn terrifying. Now's the time to sign up for fantasy basketball. Join for free. A pair of off days in Los Angeles has felled an awful lot of giants over the years, but the process proceeded unencumbered by any Hollywood haze. Embiid absolutely tortured the Los Angeles Lakers on Wednesday, annihilating Brooke Lopez, Andrew Boggett, Julius Randle and any other poor soul in Forum Blue and Gold who happened to wander into the blast radius. The stat line beggars belief, 46 points on 14 for 20 shooting, including 2 for 3 from 3 point land, and a 16 for 19 mark from the free throw line, 15 rebounds, 7 assists and 7 blocks in 34 minutes, and 29 seconds of incineration. The points, assists and blocks all represented career highs, the rebounds were one off the high water mark he set Monday against the Clips. It's the most any Sixer has scored in a game since Allen Iverson, nearly 11 years ago. It had been 35 years since an NBA player had gone for 40 with 7 dimes and 7 swats. No player since the NBA started counting blocks in in 1973 had ever put up 45-15-7-7 before NBA did it on Wednesday. And the damnedest thing was, the Sixers needed every last erg of Embiid's excellence, because the Lakers refused to break. LA just kept coming, taking a 101-100 lead on a Randall free throw with 419 to go in regulation. So Philly did what has now, after a couple of years lost to injury and frustration, begun to come naturally, throw the ball to number 21, and let him go to work. Embiid goes over 40 points with the nice move moves on Julius Randall number and bop pick dot twitter dot com b j a l m g j 6 l t all ball at Albalup, November 16, 2017. Embiid series of fakes shook Randall out of position, allowing him to step through for an and one layup that put the Sixers back on top, 103-101. Embiid shimmy pick dot twitter dot com n o v y k k x zero x d c j fogler at zero November sixteenth twenty seventeen they'd never trail again pulling away behind timely shot making from Embiid Ben Simmons and about to be very wealthy swingman Robert Covington to put the finishing touches on a one hundred fifteen one hundred nine victory that left superstar comedian in Philadelphia native Kevin Hart ranting and raving like he was on an episode of The Rights to Ricky Sanchez. Kevin Hart interview bombs Joel Embiid after his historic performance. Pick Twitter dot com U B V R D two J five S J Nick Picone at Nick Picone. November 16, 2017. Embiid, for his part, wanted to make sure we knew that he believes the best is yet to come, because he doesn't yet feel like he's in peak condition after being limited this preseason coming back from knee surgery. If he had to put a percentage on his healthy, Joel would have to say 